Data scouting and parking are special strategies designed by CMS to capture extra data for physics that is normally hard to record. In a nutshell, data scouting and data parking allows us to significantly increase the number of proton collisions we can store to disk by being selective about the specific particles we to keep and by delaying or even bypassing the full processing of the raw data. Data scouting and parking enables us to detect some of the most subtle signatures for new physics, making us 10 times more likely to detect particles with very low masses than before. We've been studying how complementary CMS's special parking and scouting data sets are in collecting low momentum light muon pairs. One exciting thing the scouting data has been used for is a very powerful search for a theorized particle called a dark photon at very low masses that CMS has never directly probed before. Electrons and photons play a vital role in CMS physics findings. It was essential to scout for them and we are excited to have observed electrons from familiar particles with the scouting data. In the B parking dataset, there are different triggers which are turned on at different time during the data taking period. And in the paper, the number of events recorded by each trigger was measured. Run three data different triggers have been studied and analyses are being conducted using the dataset. I participated in the commissioning of the B parking trigger and also in the measurement of the RK, which is a double ratio of the branching fractions of rare decays. With the new data park selection, oh. we get 12 times more data than in the route 2. In some BDKs, this is really important for the lifetime measurements. As part of our joint effort in calibration studies involving scouting jets, our aim is to attain higher position when capturing particle interactions.